Hey you guys, welcome back to another one of my videos. We are here once again at CBS. I'm going to be sharing with you guys a small little haul. It's literally really, really small. Now, the reason I came to do these deals was because I had a whole bunch of um, extra bucks that were expiring. Do you guys remember I told y'all last week that I had a CBS account that I had to close down because I didn't have any good CRTs or anything like that? Well, I think this account is starting to be the same way. I don't know if it's just me. I don't know if it's, I think it's just these accounts because I'm my other other ones I do get some pretty good CRTs but it's just these two and they were older and everything so one of them I completely closed down and then the other one this one that I'm using right here I had extra bucks expiring and I was like I think that's my sign to go ahead and like close it down use my extra bucks and kind of close it down and everything but I was like you know what I'm gonna give it one more week I don't know why it's I mean it's been going on for so so many months where I just don't get any good coupons but I was like you know what I'm gonna spend my extra bucks and then we'll see next week and if just definitely no good coupons i'll just spend my extra bucks close it down and we are good to go um but yeah i think i don't know if it's just happening to me it's my older accounts i've had since like many 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 years ago so i don't know if it's just older accounts or what's going on but i mean you guys i make i, I do youtube and you can't really do a lot of videos, a lot of deals if you don't have any good coupons. Do you know what I mean? So I don't know. I'll have to see. But anyways, I just came here to spend a whole bunch of extra bucks that were expiring. So I'm going to be starting off with the spend 20, get back five in extra bucks for the Scott paper towels, the six equal 10. Um, the Scott toilet paper, the 12 rolls, the Viva uh, paper towels, and then the Cottonelle toilet paper. So I'm going to be picking up these last uh, two co Cottonelle toilet papers. They are on sale two for 10. We do have a $2.50 digital coupon. So we're going to be using that one right there. And then I'm going to be grabbing some Scott. Now the Scott is on, um, on sale for $10.49. So two Cottonelles, um, two for 10, and then the Scott 10.49 which is going to bring it to a total of $20.49. Uh, I'm just going to be using that $2.50 coupon. It's going to bring it down to $17.99. Getting back five and extra bucks for doing the deal. Making everything after extra bucks $12.99 or $4.33 a piece. So here is a really good paper deal that we have going on. And I mean, if you're going to do a paper deal, might as well do this one. Just because we have that $2.50 coupon for the Cottonelle. And I feel like that's a really good price. If you can find four of the Cottonelle and you don't have printables, or anything like that you can just submit your receipt to shop me you'll get back two dollars and fifty for the other two but since you guys saw i only found two of the little little cotton ale so might as well just grab some scott that i actually use so here is a really good deal we have going on for the cotton ale and remember if you have any spend threshold crts you can throw all of these deals together uh use that spend threshold crt and you're going to be saving a little extra money but like i told you guys <clears throat> i don't really get good coupons I really don't get any good coupons but yeah working with what we have and it's kind of frustrating you guys i feel like cvs is just going downhill every single week i don't know i don't know that's just how i've been feeling about cvs you guys know um if you watched me from like the very beginning know that i was not a very big walgreens fan and i'm in walgreens i think more than i am at cvs but anyways, I am going to be also doing the spend 30, get back 10 and extra bucks limit of one time per account. Nothing was tagged here just yet. The cashiers were like going around tagging stuff, but I'm going to be grabbing these type pods. We do have a $3 digital and they are on sale for $13.49. And I was, I was doing my shopping with my daughter and she just has she just has to mark her territory with everything and then i'm going to be grabbing some of the downy unstoppables 13.49 we have a two dollar digital coupon that is attaching to these right here so two 13.49 items and then i'm going to be finishing it off with this gain fabric softener that is priced at five dollars and 49 cents we do have this dollar digital coupon that is attaching to the fabric softeners so this is everything for my spin 30 get back 10 and extra bucks remember i told you guys did I say that? It's a limit of one time per account. So it's going to be a total of $13.47 using the $2 for the downy, $3 for the type pods, dollar for the gain, which is $6 in coupons. It's going to bring it down to paying $26.47. Getting back 10 in extra bucks, making everything $16.47 or $5.49 a piece each item. Now, I know that's a little bit expensive, but I told you guys I'm kind of... <laughs> I'm kind of spending my extra bucks and I was like, I might as well spend them on deals that 
you know, good deals that I, that I'm actually going to be either using or like donating or yeah. But yeah, if you just want to do this deal by itself, it's going to be sixteen forty seven after extra bucks or five forty nine a piece. I feel like that's still it, it's a pretty good price to be honest. I mean, we do get Tide Pods, we get some detergent and some form of softener, so I feel like it's a, this is a pretty good price. But it would be even better on like a spin threshold tier team. And then I'm going to be doing my Maybelline favorite deal of the week: spend fifteen get back five and extra bucks limit of one time per account. Now I know that. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, I always share this deal whenever it comes around. I was low on concealer and I really, really needed some concealer. I'm just like a concealer, conceal and go type of gal. I do like to use full, I like to do full phases of makeup every once in a while, but I just kind of like a concealer, a little bit of mascara and we are good to go. And you guys, the Maybelline concealers are so good so so good so i'm going to be grabbing two that are priced at 9.29 which is going to be a total of 18.58 i'm going to be using this three dollar instant coupon all accounts should have it a three out 15 maybelline crt and a three dollar digital coupon so um after the coupons is going to bring it down to 9.58 but in this account i had a little wompy <laughs> a little wompy uh 20 percent off one purchase no 20% off what is it 20% off one item there we go it's not 20% off my entire purchase it's on one item which is just going to reduce it um I think that's equivalent to like 78 cents if I'm not mistaken yeah. so after that three off 15 three dollar instant coupon three dollar digital the 20% off one item it's going to bring it down to 879 getting back five and extra bucks for doing the deal making both of these after extra bucks 372 or a dollar and 86 cents a piece and I feel like that's a really really good price for me because I tell you guys I love I love 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 this concealer right here it's not like very heavy on the skin you got to have a good prep skin of course before doing any makeup I just kind of do like moisturizer a little bit of primer some concealer and mascara and we are good to go but yeah i'm going to be doing first the maybelline just because i was using that 20 percent off to be honest i thought it was going to take off a little bit more that's why i paid for it first <laughs> if not i would have just paid everything together and it would have been fine but here are my maybelline after fighting with them but yeah the the 20 off did take off 78 cents yeah i was trying to do the math here in my calculator that i have in my hand but um yeah, it came down to eight seventy two to pay, but getting back five in extra bucks, making them three seventy two or a dollar and eighty six cents. But I really, really like these concealers, and I was like, uh, I might as well take them because I really do need them. And I was low on concealer, anyways. And then I was going to do the spin 30, get 10, and the Connell on a separate transaction because I told you guys I had a whole bunch of um, extra books that were expiring. But everything came off perfectly fine. The Tide Pods, the Downy Fabric Softener, the Gain Softener, the Downy Unstoppables, I'm sorry. And then the $2.50 for the Connell, 10 and extra books for the spin 30, get 10, and then 5 and extra bucks for the cotton So I told you guys I was in and out really quickly and I was like might as well might as well record. But yeah you guys that's going to be it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you're subscribed, like this video, and I will see you guys in another video.